How's it going on YouTube? Um, I'm going to show you that MS works on the 3G and the 3GS. Um, this is my new 3GS, but you can do this with the 3G as well, as long as it's running 3.0. Uh, <clears throat> I, I believe the old iPhone, the first generation, won't be able to do this, but I'm, I'm not certain. Okay. Go into messaging just like normal. Okay. You can see I already sent some messages to myself. This is just my phone number in here. I added in the context. Uh, the new thing is this little button on here, it's this little camera button. It brings up your uh, options for MMS. Okay, you can either take a photo or video or choose existing. So choose existing. Okay, go into your camera roll. Um, you could choose a video if you wanted to. Um, I'm just going to choose uh, this picture of my iPhone. Just go quick. Um, and I haven't been able to send a video over probably about a minute to a minute and 15 seconds. Um, I just think it's probably too large. That's why most uh, cell phones won't let you send one over 30 seconds. So it's pretty typical, but kind of frustrating. You can write something in here if you want. Okay, oops. If I'm able to. Okay, let's say test. Okay. Um, and then, uh, you, I mean, you don't have to. Okay. Hit send. It was very quick, depending on the, the the size of it. Okay, I'll turn it off so you can see what it looks like when we get one. Oh, we already got it. Okay, it's bad lighting, but uh, basically it just shows a little pic, little picture, and then the, whatever it says underneath. Okay, and then there it is. Um, you can either hit it and open it up and uh, save it. You can crop it. Take take a screenshot um, or you could hold down and copy it so those are your options um, basically the way I did this you don't need to unlock or jailbreak your iPhone or mess with anything like that the iPhones are ready and capable to send MMS, MMS as you just saw at and is just waiting until they built up their 3G network a little bit more um, they're worried that if everyone who has an iPhone starts sending a bunch of MMS um, that that their network's not going to be able to handle it, it's going to get really slow, possibly crash, uh, so they're building it up. They keep pushing back the day to this, they first said, uh, like, mid-summer, then late summer, and now the date they said is September 25th, but I didn't really want to wait. So I just go, went ahead and did this. Um, it took me about five minutes at the most. It was really quick. Um, I have easy step-by-step -step instructions on how to do this if you go to my blog, and that is... Um, it, it it's an iPhone blog that I made. Um, it's kind of stupid, I know, but I feel like doing it. Oh, let's see. You go to everything iPhone now. Dot blogspot. Dot com, and I'll put that in the description for you. Okay, and uh, do some landscape. And there we go. Everything iPhone now, and it's this newest post and there's uh, really easy instructions on how to do this basically you're going to be downloading um, a setting for your iPhone and that'll kind of you know it'll reveal the MMS feature on your phone and then you'll be putting your SIM card into another AT&T phone and uh, logging on to uh, AT&T.com and then uh, making so, so that your account recognizes that you're not using iPhone anymore, and then it, it'll re-enable uh, messaging, and then you put your card right back in your iPhone, and you're good to go. So it's really easy. Um, just watch my, or go check out my blog. I wanted to put it on my blog so that maybe I could get some more people looking at it. Uh, I just started it, and uh, and I want to get some people, uh, a lot of good discussions about um, cases, applications, uh, new software, that kind of stuff. So anyways, uh, rate this video, please, if you liked it. And uh, hopefully, if you have any problems, you can email me or send me a YouTube message. Or on my blog, you can just post a comment, right? Like, there, comment, and ask me right there. Alright, good luck.